Greetings from Goofy Faces. I'm Robert Bauer, owner and president, speaking to you from my art studio where I draw live at virtual parties around the world. So many families and businesses are conducting more virtual gatherings these days in order to remain healthy while keeping in touch with one another. Here at Goofy Faces, we've been busy helping out by offering our creative services remotely to families and businesses. Whether your company is doing a virtual team building event or your family is celebrating a graduation or birthday party, here are a few tips to make your next Zoom gathering a huge success. Make sure to place your device with the camera at eye level so that way the artist can see you straight on. They don't want to be looking at you like this because then you look like you're about 40 feet tall. If you've booked us for your Zoom party and you've decided to be the host, always make sure that you have the option to allow guests to share their screen. This way, our artists are able to show in live time the drawing as it takes place, like that. Avoid setting up in front of a window, unless you want to be drawn as a silhouette. On average, it takes our artists about six minutes to capture a good likeness. What makes that six minutes go much, much smoother is if you face forward and you sit still. If one of your Zoom guests is literally in the same room with you at the moment that you're online, it's extremely important that you have them disconnect your audio. Because if they don't, you end up with an extreme feedback and echo like this. Try not to eat while the artist is drawing you. If you want us to see your eyes in the drawing, make sure not to wear sunglasses. The same goes with hats. If you want to be drawn with a hat, fine. But if you want us to see what your hair looks like, you'll have to remove it. Make sure to position your camera as close to your face as possible. That way the artist can see you better and hear you better. I hope you'll find these tips helpful for your next Zoom party. For more tips, check out our blog with the link below.